Hey guys, Bradley here at True Outdoors, and today I'm doing another High Point Products equipment review. Now, these two products, um, I'm doing both of them in one video because one of them, uh, they're pretty short reviews, so I'm just going to put them two in one. I'll start with this one for a review because this is a neat little accessory. It's a hook, and it's called the bow holster, and if you have a belt, or a safety harness when you're hunting you put it on your side and I'll grab my bow right here is how it's supposed to work is you hook this on your bow handle get it on there. Kind of the quiver. you put it on there like that and it's a bow holster you can put it on your hip right there but I've actually never used this had it for like two years and I've never used it because I have a youth bow and this grip is too small because when you put it in there it just falls and it won't hold it like holster so <sighs> I really can't say how good it is it's a neat concept and I'm sure it works great with adult bows and bigger bows and I'll probably be getting a new bow sometime in the future but for right now I can't really review it because I've never used it so like I said it looks neat looks like it'd work good and I can't wait to try it when I get a bigger bow but yeah there we go review on High Point Products bow holster. Now for the main review, and this is the High Point Products Retrieval Device. And for the most part, it's pretty good, but it's a really good concept, but it's just like, I think they could have designed it a little bit better because all it is really is a plastic reel with a thin nylon cord and a little clip on the end. And it can retract like this, but then you got this tiny little knob and you're just gotta twist the whole entire thing. And it's a little bit impractical. I would have liked to have seen, like, I think it would have been cool if they could have just beefed it out a bit more. Maybe put some kind of a gear or something. Of course, it probably would have been monstrously big. But I guess it's still a neat concept for, like, um, climber stands. I'll clip it on there. Still got the clip. And the clip is really good because it's small. And it's, um, it, you can pull it open pretty easy. So it'll work on probably any clamp tree stand. But... Yeah, most of the time when I use it, and I have used this, I used it this past year, usually I end up just putting it around my bow, and it works for that, I can put it on my bow real quick, just hook it on itself like that, there we go, and it holds it good, but that's a lot of weight, and this reel does not hold it at all, and all you have is a tiny little handle about half an inch big there's no way you can use just that handle it really best way is to just pull the string up yourself then you got a pile of string then you just roll it back around so it's it's a good concept i think it definitely could be useful i just don't think i think it could have been better i think they could have made it hold on a second. so like i said i think it's a neat concept and it'll work all right and for just if you're looking for a retrieval rope, it does, I think it beats just having a plain rope because you can wind it up, it's tiny, I can fit it in my pocket, not even know it's there. It weighs absolutely nothing, probably just a couple of ounces. So it works good, but I think if you were going to go with an actual roll, I would have made it a different way. I would have put some gears in it, make it a little more heavy duty, you know, so then you can actually like put a big crank handle, like kind of like a fishing reel style then you can just crank it right up no problem but then it wouldn't have been as easy to pack in for bow hunters and people with climber stands but I'll snap it on this climber stand so y'all can see it quick. so here it is clipped onto this climber stand this climber has really big tubing so if we can fit this I'm sure it can fit just about anything and it's solid like it's not going anywhere it's stuck on there real solid but I've actually never really used it clipped onto a tree stand because you can't use this to pull a bow up with. You know, bows just weigh too much. They weigh too much, and this thing just, I mean, you'd have to be using two hands on this little handle. So really, you either do it like that, or you just, if it's all the way down here, you really, you just pull the string up. That's mainly what I've realized I use it. So guys, there is my review on High Point Products retrieval device and their bow holster they're right here and um so bow holster 
I'm not going to say whether I recommend it or not. I would say yeah because it's a pretty good price and it looks pretty heavy duty. It's solid and I'm sure it could handle an adult bow easier but I really can't say whether it's good or not because I can't really use it on my youth bow. And the retrieval device, I'd recommend it because I think anything beats just having a big pile of rope that you'd have to tie up. And So it's a, it's a sturdy cord. The cord's never broke but I just think that if the concept is good I think they could have just made the concept better by adding you know an actual useful crank because it's almost not even you almost don't even need the little tiny crank on there I mean, it's just a little peg but so there's my review on it and I recommend their retrieval device go get you one they're not much and it'll work just fine and next next review is going to be the last high point products review and it is the beefed up awesome works pretty good cup holder in the next video so thanks for watching and also just recently i just broke 100 subscribers on youtube which is awesome i've never gotten that far on youtube i've been on two channels and i've never gotten this far so it's really cool thank you so much to you guys who watch and support this channel i'm just kidding likes hunting and doing these reviews so thanks for supporting me and stay tuned to the end because i'm gonna give something away to y'all so see you in a minute Hey guys, Bradley here at True Outdoors, and you just finished watching the review on the High Point products. And I said I'm going to give something away to y'all to celebrate 100 subscribers. Thank you so much to you guys who support this channel. I love doing it, going to keep doing it. And um, just a huge thank you to you guys, and show give something away to y'all. So this is a Primos, just picked this up at the store. Um, I have never reviewed one of these. It is a Primos True Double. I didn't realize till after I bought it that it said true. But um, anyway, this is a piggyback stacked frame. It has a picture of Will Primos there on it. And uh, looks pretty neat. It's kind of cool. It has like two reeds on it. It's, uh, it is stacked, so I thought that was kind of neat. Never used one, so whoever gets this is going to be the first one to try it because I've never used one of these, but anyway, so to win this, all you gotta do is be a subscriber and comment on this video. Just subscribe, or if you're already subscribed, just go on this video below, comment, say something, and I will write your name on a piece of paper, put it in a hat, and pick a name out. And I will announce the winner in the next video. So I'm gonna leave this video up for maybe a week or so to make sure everybody gets a chance to comment. Then, give this call away. Thank you so much to you guys for uh, just helping me to make this dream possible and uh, I'm just so blessed to be able to do this and just thank the Lord for it but anyway so thank you so much and I guess I'll see y'all in the next video and I'm going to tell you who's going to win this call so and also next review for calls is going to be the Will Primos one it's a his custom personal call it's pretty neat but um, I'll be reviewing this call in another video. Happy spring. Thank you so much to you guys. Thanks for watching. God bless. And I will see you in the next video.